What is going on, guys? Welcome to the next episode with your Blythe Spartans. We are in the playoffs right now, about to take on Stockport. Team is ready to go, and hopefully we can get out of this with a win and hopefully get promoted so we can stay on schedule. Set that there. We're good there. I'm very confident because we have Dan the Man, our secret weapon, and we're off to a hot start. Here we go. This is it. Our season can either end or we can keep going. Yep, make the change. Let's go, boys. We've played well all year long. I don't see why we would uh, stop now. Come on. There, there, come on. Turner's in the clear. Uh, come on now. Work the ball in the box. We got Dan McGuire in there. Goal kick for us. Come on now. All right, so we're playing all right. Playing well. We have a lot of fouls. A lot of fouls. What is going on? There it is. Oh, uh, no. Come on. Don't go into halftime tied up. We should go. Oh, no. This this is not going to happen. We're not going to lose. Oh, what a shot, though. What a kick by Dixon. Not quite a scissors kick, but a nice little roundhouse kick to get the ball in the back of the net. One more minute. Is that it? Nope. All right. Uh, I think we're good for right now. Yeah, we're good. Come on now. Something's got to give. Dan McGuire, I'm looking at you down here at 6.4. You're lucky Owen Bridge isn't here. I'd put him in. Lucky his leg's broken. All right, come on now. Come on, boys. Get, get one in the back of the net. We need one. At least tie it, because I, I think we're the most talented team in the league. We can, uh, we can handle a penalty shootout. Come on now, get there, get there. Come on. Their goalie is playing unreal right now. Come on now, Hingecliff. Mid center. Got you right here. Curtis Peters, go in right there. And then I don't have another one. Sorry, fam. Attacking mid right. I got that right here. For Jarrett Rivers. And then uh, that's it. Give it a little bit more time. Or actually attacking mid center, I don't. I have uh, defenders left. Eh, not yet. I'll keep going a little bit more. This should be where we excel. In the in the depth area. Come on now. Oh, come on. Come on, boys. We're playing we're playing all right. We're out shooting them. Come on. Look at we got the banners up. Sean Reed is hurt. Oh no. This isn't good. Mid center. I think I'm just gonna have to put a defensive guy in there and just move him back. Oh, not good, Sean Reed. I'm going to have to put, uh, is it you? Which one of you goes back? Uh, Buttle goes back. All right, so this is, uh, this is what we've come down to, our playoff hopes. <laughs> oh, this isn't good. Bad luck. Bad, bad luck. All right, give the team a talk. Come on. We got about 10 minutes Definitely get us into at least overtime. There it is. There. Oh, come on. Dan McGuire. Come on. Don't let it end. Curtis Peters. Uh, somebody. Somebody. Nope. How? How does that happen? How are we the most dominant team all year? And then as soon as we hit the playoffs, we're just laying an egg. Dan McGuire laid an egg. 6.2. Worst player on our team. 
Best player, worst rating. Not good. So that's it. It's the end of our season. No promotion. Ugh. Tough. So I will do a season overview. Kind of see where we are right now. So this is our... Oh yeah, we don't really have an under 18 team. Uh, under 23s. This is where we are um, in terms of this. Yeah, if we're very secure, we're not going to get fired. We have 129,000. Maybe I'll uh, maybe I'll do something over here. Um, let's see what we need. Um, not very good uh, in terms of stars, but we are only a semi-pro team. Um, oh yeah, I can click this and then see. Our average attendance was a thousand, and our seating capacity is four thousand. Oh, but only five hundred sixty-three seated. All right. Um, yeah, maybe I'll upgrade our stadium a little bit. You know, add some more seats, and we should be good. Two-year sponsorship deal, nineteen thousand. Poor facilities, but uh, I think I would much rather add seats. Uh, limited youth recruitment. I can tell. Uh, maybe I'll try and upgrade that a little bit. I'll probably have to see how much sponsorship money we get. Um, and then also whoever else is about to get sold. Um, who would be worth... The only people that are probably going to get sold is, is Dan McGuire. But um, I'm not going to let anybody walk for free. Sean Reed, the Sean Reed injury really hurt us. Um, the Atkinson injury probably hurt us too. I maybe could have started him. Yeah, no, his condition was only 82%. He would have only, I actually probably should have started him and then taken him out, you know, a half time or something because we started Joshua Murray and that's, that's on me. I'll take the, I'll take the fall for that. A one and a half star difference. And, uh, yeah, he would have been, he would have been a sub for us. Um, well, you live and you learn, so hopefully we can retain most of uh, most of our team. Um, I guess we have a couple people coming up. Um, Dave is probably gonna go. He's probably gonna leave. But even then, like I have uh, Dylan. Uh, I don't think he's on the. No, he's not. He's an under twenty three player. But I can still call him up. Uh, we should be fine. I'm not worried about having to go out and spend, uh, you know, a bunch of money on players or anything like that. Um, a couple upgrades here and there, and then uh, we should definitely get promoted next season, especially with um, uh, I have I can't remember um, one or two. Um, I have one or two um qualifications uh, my, my national b so that's and i'm getting my national a right now so you know i will be will be better for next season for sure um our coaching could be a little bit better maybe i send a couple people out on a um coaching course or so maybe i try to add one um we'll see but other than that um I don't know how much downtime we have until um, next season. I'll see. Um, oh, so we're going to have to get rid of one person because we're over by 28,000. But um, we'll be fine. I'll get rid of this guy and this guy. And that'll be pretty close to 28,000. It might be the full. Might not be the full 28,000. But um, yeah, we should be all right. Um other than that, our sponsorship money should go up because, uh, you know, we only have um, one sponsorship deal in place. Maybe we'll get a New Jersey sponsor or something. Actually, I think we got one earlier in the year. Let's see. Finances. Uh, sponsors and other. We have until 2018. So we have um, uh, our season ticket holders. That's fine. General sponsorship. 
um, ground, main, and our other ground. So we should hopefully get a couple more sponsors. And they should be decent because um, we did all right. It's not like we did that bad. Um, what's our lowest one is our club memberships. Maybe I will upgrade our stadium. I think we own it, but I'm not sure. Let's see. Facilities. Ground. Build new ground. Yeah, so we own it. So we should be um, club owned by us. Yes. So our... Um, so we should be able to upgrade our stadium and everything like that. But... Um, until then, this is our team for now. I'm probably going to call up. I mean, I don't really want to call him up because he's only a two star. I'd prefer a two and a half, like uh, basically all of these people. And then um, these two will leave. So then that'll leave us with everyone from here up. And so that should be good. So I think next year is definitely our year for promotion. And so I hope you guys stay tuned and stick around and see what happens next season.